Seth 3, 101. This is getting crazy, okay? Now, I know the economy is bad and all, but why? Why does this stuff like this happen? <clears throat> In case you don't know what I'm talking about, maybe you haven't heard yet, or I don't know. Every Friday after Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving, American holiday, I, you know, every Friday after Thanksgiving, they call it in the retail world Black Friday. Black Friday is when they take the prices of stuff and mark it down in retail stores. And, in, and those prices only exist on that day, the day after Thanksgiving, Friday, Black Friday. So for example, let's say that uh, this little clock here was like uh, 80 bucks, and you know, for Black Friday only, you can get it for 65. Okay? They'll stock it up, big old piles of them, and just have them ready for Black Friday. But they will not start to sell till like 4 or 5 a.m. So, what do people do on Black Friday? And around this country, I guess this goes on in country, I don't know. In this, you know it goes on here in the United States. They wait outside the doors. Some of them go as far as camp outside. They make it like it's a Super Bowl thing just to save possibly 20 bucks on an item. Okay? But that's beside the point. And they're all standing there right, right there at the door. As soon as the doors open, they all storm into the store. Okay, so here's the incident. And this is, this is sad. See, I used to work at Walmart. I worked at Walmart a lot. I have a lot of friends at Walmart. The, the door greeters at Walmart a lot of times can be some of the nicest people there. Some can be some of the grumpiest too. But that's beside the point. The thing is, you, someone out there, could you just imagine you killed somebody because you did not regard their safety, their well-being, their life, just so you can go get that laptop, that flat screen TV, or whatever in the hell it was you wanted, so you just ran right over the person? I don't know whether it was a man or a woman. I'm not sure. Regard it doesn't really make a difference. You killed somebody killed somebody by trampling over them at a Walmart on Black Friday. Now, what if that was somebody's child? What if you trampled somebody's child on Black Friday? What if you killed a six-year-old girl to get your flat-screen TV at about $30, $40 cheaper than what it normally is? Is that little girl's life worth that television? Or did you even stop to look? That if Did you even turn around to see if she was okay? Now, it wasn't a little girl that got killed. It was a Walmart associate, to be more exact. Not an employee. Walmart calls them associates. You trampled over them. You can't tell me you can't notice somebody under... I mean, the last time I walked on somebody, and it has happened at some of our New Year's Eve party, you know, it's very unstable. It's very well noticeable. And you mean to tell me that you had no idea? Of course, it's, it's like vultures. I mean, people talk about how, in other parts of the world, how... People treat other people, I mean, I'm not going to give examples, but like, you know, there was all kinds of things going on with, since this war in Iraq has taken place, okay? All right. So, what makes any different? Somebody doing their job, and they get killed for it because you have no regard to their, wow. I don't know. I mean, just, wow. I thought I heard something. It just doesn't. I don't know. It, it it's it's sad, but I know the economy's bad. But this something you hear something like this every year. But this this was the worst that I think ever. Every, every year, it's always at a Walmart, and it's not funny. But it's always at a Walmart. Somebody says every year a Walmart associate gets hurt, but this year somebody died because somebody else wanted to save money. How can you go on 
No one. I mean, how can you go on staring at this television that you bought, knowing that you could have possibly been the one who killed that worker just to get that? And it sits there as a reminder in your home. Because nine times out of ten, people are not buying for other people. They're going in there to get the stuff for themselves. Hmm. I don't know. That's really crazy. That's all i got to say for now. I'm going to talk to you later.